news today that Damar Hamlin is going back to the Buffalo Bills after he had that cardiac event on the field during an NFL game where they used an AED device to give him immediate life-saving treatment. Well, the junior ROTC at Forest Hill Community High School, they heard about this and it inspired them to do a mission. Uh, Mr. Paez, what is that mission? Well, uh, our mission is to provide our community with not just the tools and information, but anything they could need in order to prevent these lives that could have been saved if just an AD was available or if someone that knew how to operate an AD was there to help them out. And you gave me some stats earlier about how many people have cardiac events that are in high school. Yeah, um, uh, according to the studies, uh, one in 80,000 of high school athletics is... They have, a, they have an event. Yeah. A cardiac event. event. And when you consider that around 8 million high school students participate in athletics every year, it's no surprise that, that, leading, that the leading cause of death is cardiac. Sorry, cardiac That's crazy. Arrest. So that really inspired your uh, Master Sergeant group of students to do something about it. Yes, we did. I showed them the video of, of Hamil Hamlin passing out on the field and it inspired them. It was something that they wanted to do. They want to do something for the community. They said, let's raise funds. Let's see if we can get equipment into the school to augment what we already have. And they are on this. They want to do this. That's why they reached out to you. Yeah, they literally spammed us. Like everybody sent us an email. Uh, but you guys have a drill that you're doing this morning. Can you show us that drill? Yes, we can. So we're going over here to uh, Umania. She's going to go through the drill and see what we do as uh, ROTC cadets. We've also helped out the school. So Umania. Hey, hey, are you OK? Are you OK? Let's check the boat. Someone get an AED. Call 911. Go to the main office and wait for the ambulance. Now they're like what, scrambling to find the AED and have all been dispatched and here comes. And she found an AED machine. And what, what's this officer's name? She is Leon. And Leon is starting the machine and it, it just, it talks to you and tells you exactly what to do. You can't get, get it wrong with the machine. It tells you everything you need to do. It's already talking to her, telling her to put pads on them. It shows you where the pads go. And it's talking, you can't hear because of all the traffic noise, right. but it's literally walking them through it's all the steps. It's walking her through the entire thing. Once you hit on, it does everything for you and you have you can't get it wrong. And it even tells you when to clear. Now, so these guys at the Junior ROTC are trying to get these devices more in their school and their community. If you want to help them out, they have a GoFundMe on our website, WPTV.com. I'm just amazed at your students and what they know and compared to what I didn't know in the 90s. <laughs> they are amazing students and they've really wanted to do this. They have wrapped their hearts around doing this for the community and for our school. So one life they save is worth every penny that they get. I love that. Thank Back to you guys in the studio.